It's often claimed that evolution is simply change over time, and since change over time can be seen everywhere, then evolution is obviously true. But highly qualified creation scientists say there is much more to it than that. For evolution to have turned particles into people, simple change over time is not enough. A special kind of change is needed, that is, naturally occurring change that adds new genetic instructions. No one has seen this special kind of change happen. Darwin's finches, peppered moths and adapting bacteria are all examples of naturally occurring change, but not one of them shows the addition of new genetic instructions. Not one of them writes any brand new genetic code specifying how to make some new complex feature, such as feathers for lizards, for example. And since codes and programs cannot write themselves, there must have been a designer for all living things. هل تثبت نظرية التطور أمام الفحص العلمي؟ وهل هي أفضل النظريات في مسألة الخلق؟ هل تؤيد الاكتشافات الحديثة والتقدم العلمي هذه النظرية؟ مجلة الخلق برنامج يأتيكم كل خميس على شاشة قناة الحياة في المواعيد التالية.